Hey guys, this is Dwayne and I want to welcome you to another video from All About the Banks. Today we are in Conway, South Carolina and we're staying at Carolina Pines. Hey guys, we have been married for 36 years. We got hitched January 36 years ago. Talk about getting hitched. In our uh, let latest video, you saw where I hooked up the truck and I thought about it and I know there's a lot of videos out there about hitches, speaking of getting hitched, um, but I wanna show you my hitch because it's a little different than some of the ones that, that you see. Uh, it's not as popular and I haven't seen that many videos on YouTube about it. So I wanna show you our hitch and uh, give you a little information about it. I wanna show you uh, the Blue Ox Super Ride fifth wheel hitch. That was cool, I know it was. This is the Blue Ox 20K fifth wheel hitch. Blue Ox only makes one fifth wheel hitch. And as you can see here, the head is made out of uh, a plastic. It's like the same plastic uh, spacer that you would put on a fifth wheel hitch, but it's about that thick. Uh, all of the construction is welded steel. The one thing that I did like about this hitch uh, that drew me to it actually is the fact that it has no bolts other than the bolts that hold this this plate onto the frame. This hitch has three parts, the head, the arms, and then the frame down here. As you can see, all of the construction is welded steel. And I'll try to get a closer shot of it in a little bit. I like this hitch because it had very little uh, in the way of failure points. By that I mean it didn't have bolts attaching angled metal together. It was all steel. Uh, the hitch I had prior to this one was a slider hitch because I had a six and a half foot bed on my previous F-250. I don't need that as now with this eight foot bed on the 350, but I think the smart thing that I did was when I bought the hitch, it attaches via a gooseneck, which most trucks now come standard. Well, most trucks that have a towing package come standard with a gooseneck connection. That allowed me to just transfer this hitch from my previous truck to this truck. If I'd have gone with a puck system, one that has the four attachments in here, I may would have had to buy another hitch to fit this truck specifically. Uh, I will show you around the hitch as far as some of the things that I like about it and what I think uh, is good about it. It does slide back and I'll show you that in just a minute. But I wanted to show you this hitch, one, because I haven't seen too many reviews on YouTube about it, and I think it's a good hitch. This uh, Blue Ox hitch is a BXR6200 Super Ride 20K fifth wheel hitch. Uh, it attaches to a 2 and 5 16 gooseneck ball. And like I said before, it has a uh, hitch is rated for 20K and the gross towing weight uh, is 5,000 pounds tongue weight. I'm sorry, gross towing weight and a 5,000 pound tongue weight. I want to point out here, right here, you have those extra points where they're added for stability and it's welded. This is steel. And then inside, I can get it in there. Right down here, 
is the box that attaches to the gooseneck ball and it attaches by these two steel rods and then you torque it to the manufacturer's uh, torque specifications and at the top that bolt is what pulls it up and there's one more area around here on the front these two you snug those down and it attaches the whole assembly so there's one two three four five points that this hitch uh, is attached or held to that gooseneck ball all right on the inside there are actual rubber cushions um, if I can get in there one on the bottom and one on the top these are very good for helping to dampen the shock from the camper um, I know some hitches have air this one helps with the ride it, it, it helps the head float up and down uh, here I will show you how thick some of the steel is and how it operates if you have a six and a half foot bed it easily slides back I've never had this to fail and I my previous one slider hitch when I had a six and a half foot bed it would work about 20% of the time but it was held together with bolts and rods and all that kind of stuff this is simply made but I think it's well made super ride blue ox 20k 5th wheel And uh, the reason I like this hitch is I is because I was able to switch it from my six and a half foot bed to my eight foot bed when I switched trucks without buying another hitch. Uh, these trucks, if they have the towing package, most of them come with a puck system or either puck system and the goose ball. And the puck system is designed for a specific hitch. So I think I did very good because I did not have to buy another hitch. All I had to do was take it out of one truck and put it in the other truck. That's the advantage of the goose, uh, the gooseneck ball system and a gooseneck ball hitch. Uh, I, don't, I don't know, I don't think my other puck system hitch would have fit in this truck. Not sure, but I didn't have to buy another hitch. Also, let me know how the audio is doing because it's windy. I'm trying a new uh, microphone that has the dead cat on it. Let me see if I can switch it around. So, it has a dead cat on it. And I'm trying to see how it does in the wind. Uh, so I'll see how it, how it sounds in post. Uh, we are hanging out at... That's a bad shot at Carolina Pines, uh, it's our anniversary Tuesday. This is su uh, Saturday, so we'll be hanging out probably for several more days. We have one or two more places we want to visit.